know, talking to a lot of the South African riders, you guys are super pumped to have all these guys here, and uh, it's just a party. Let's let's have some fun, let's ride some bikes, and most importantly, let's get some girls' phone numbers! Yeah! This is definitely the first time like a big street contest has ever happened in South Africa. The Cape Town riders. Oh, what the? What a rollerblader putting it. All the Cape Town dudes, all the South African guys are like blown away. They're just they're seeing a Ben Lewis, Dan Lacey like. Not the mic fucker movies, I'm some next level. My fucker groupies are groupies. So what you gonna do when you move the fucker boat sales? I'm gonna eat you with my piggy bank sings. Move back to my mom. Playing real life for a scumbag. This dude was killing it. He's trying to crank on around the rail. Broke his chain. We're gonna get him back riding and we're gonna see that crank on ground. <laughs> Man, that kid. He gets the, the tough guy of the award day because he took it so many times trying this rail and he took it a couple times really hard. Fuck it, oh, go faster. <laughs> he just did it. It's going so slow and kind of landing uphill and I don't know how his wrists are holding up to that. We can jump over this lady. Go a bit fast and then just fucking send it. Oh! You're the next Clint Jacobs. He's taking it to the next level, man. Is that next level? Yeah, uh, you, I... You've done things that big. The reception has been brilliant. To be honest, I weren't expecting that many locals to be riding today. To come all the way from the UK, being in South Africa is pretty well, yeah, next level. That is awesome! Awesome band, man! Dude. Ow! Fuck! Awesome hurts. Oh, Ben! What the fuck was that? Oh, what? Like, for the locals, it's amazing because we don't get, like, this level of uh, attention. I mean, there's people in Cape Town that are kept a secret from the people in Cape Town. If you know what I mean, like, they're quite underground, man. The best of them, and. In, in South Africa, at least, has always been rooted in like the big stuff. Like, you know, you, you got into riding from seeing somebody jump a gap like that. You know, lots of these guys just they weren't even riding in front of like cameras and stuff, guy. Like, they they some of the piss and they just sat all day just watching, you know, because that's the how they do. What's that called? I think called on black. We roll cold road pants and chilled up here. Stone cold shirts, orange bomber jackets, tight walkmans and pick and pipe packets. I come from a town where no one's fuck a from. A little bit of money and poof and they're gone. But I'm bell of a blue CY till I die. So I'm down to bell and fuck a CY. You fuck a bell. That's him pride right there. You fuck a whole fucker. Yeah. Yeah. international guys to come ride, hang out, and uh, it's been so sick meeting all of you guys. Uh, you guys have an awesome BMX scene here. You got an amazing, amazing country. I'm definitely coming back. But honestly, like, I, I really got that feeling that everyone, all the South African dudes were just like, whoa, this is cool. This is really cool. This is just everyone on the street riding together and hanging out, but uh, this will be remembered forever in BMX in South Africa. Thanks, South Africa. It's been a full pleasure.